I'm here with Patrick Mills from Tampa, Florida, contestant in the Dogwood Invitational. And Patrick, I love your story. You played in the Patriot All-American this year, which each player honors a fallen soldier. Yeah. But you've taken it to the next level here. Yeah. Um, back when uh, I was in high school, I actually almost qualified in through uh, academic honor roll and, and playing all that kind of stuff. And I heard about the tournament, and I knew when I went to college that uh, that would be my goal because the only way is to be named an All-American. And so my freshman year, I played well. Uh, I got All-American status, and I, from the second I got the status, I knew I was going to the tournament. And just the experience out there, it's it's unbelievable. And so um, I knew when I came home, I wanted to do something different. And uh, so my family, we made the personal donation for the bag uh, because the, the point of it is supposed to take it back to your school and auction it off. And the proceeds go to Folds of Honor, which I think is amazing. But um, I, I kind of had this other idea come in my head. And then so my family made the donation. And later this summer, I'm actually delivering the bag uh, to the family. Uh, the wife and uh, son of uh, Sergeant Skornak and uh, actually to his fa mother and father as well, they will be there. And um, it just, I can't wait to do it. Uh, I've, it's been an honor carrying this bag for six months. Uh, I've been able to use it in school events. Uh, we, we play an event on a Marine base and I use it out there not only to honor him, but to honor any Marine that had served out of that base that had uh, been killed in action just because of that's the point of this tournament, that's the point of the bag. It's not to represent the players, it's to represent the soldiers and their sacrifice for this country. Well, you have really taken something to heart and you're a passionate guy, I can tell yeah. by talking to you. Yeah. And uh, you're patriotic, obviously. Yeah. But uh, how did the family receive it? When you when you made contact, did you make a phone call and how did they receive this, that you wanted to bring the bag back? Uh, I actually, I sent an email. So it took a while. We had to kind of go through a lot of different ways just to, so I can have permission to contact the family. Um, when I finally got the okay and I got her email, uh, I sent the, I sent his, you know, his, uh, his wife an email, just basically letting her know who I am, uh, and you know the that the, I had the opportunity of representing her husband in, in the tournament, and um, that it just didn't stop there. I, I told her right from the start that you know it's been an honor, and I, I've taken it to uh, multiple tournaments. Uh, it, you know, it's been around the nation. And uh, it even made an appearance at the national championship, which was, <laughs> which I thought was nice. And the response I got from her was just, wow. She had no words. That's all she could say. And uh, she, you know, she gave me her contact info, and uh, she just told me that they're coming down. They live in Tennessee, which I, I said, I like, look, I'll road trip it up there. I'm like, you know, and she's like, no, actually, his his family lives in Marietta, which is about, you know, 35 minutes away from where I live currently, and so. Uh, so she's like, you know, we'll, we'll be down over summer and, you know, we'd love it for you to bring it in so that his, his mom and dad could could see it as well and uh, could share in the experience of, of uh, receiving the bag. Well, congratulations on doing this and for taking something so good and making it even better. And maybe you'll be the first of, of many to do this. But I love what that tournament stands for. And when I heard your story, I wanted you to yeah. tell AmateurGolf.com. So thanks, Patrick Mills. Thank you so much.